What's poppin' guys, this is Water Dragon, and we are finally at that moment, stung by a bullet ant. Alright, Coyote, this is the part that you've been really trying to get to, the most painful sting in the insect kingdom. I am looking forward to this. Let's get into it. We have caught a bullet ant and we have it in the glass capsule and right now Mark is filming the final macro shots and I am two, yes, two minutes away from being stung by the insect that supposedly has the most painful sting in the insect kingdom. I think I'm going to be fine but, ooh guys, the heart rate is going today. Yeah, I bet. <sighs> this is it. One. Uh, the extra jaw inside the other jaw. Two, three. Oh, it's stuck in my arm! It's stuck in my arm! Ah! Ooh! It's stuck in his arm? Hidden within the darkness of the Costa Rican rainforest, a legend exists beneath the ancient canopy. Indigenous people refer to it as bala, which means bullet. It is rumored that just a single sting from this animal is so excruciating that it feels as if one has been shot with a gun. I just saw an ant up on the tree here. Come up really slow, this might be a nest. You think you got a nest? I mean, the ground looks the same as it has in most of the jungle, but there's a hole here. I definitely saw a large ant moving up on the side of that, but before I just storm up there. Did you just see one or do you see I a saw few? One ant, one ant. But this looks like there's a hole right there. Where? You see that? This looks like it could be a nest. I don't see the hole. Can you point to it? Oh, I just saw there's, there's one coming out right there. Coming out. He's definitely right there. Let's see if I can get him on the stick. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Oh, it's going right towards my hand. That is a bullet ant right there. Hold on, I'm just gonna put it in the container. Ah! Oh. Mark, watch out. Watch out. I think there's. They get one on me? I think so, man. I think they're swarming. We have definitely found a bullet ant nest. Yo, no you guys was surrounded uh, by was bullet ants and get getting stung. And they started swarming out. Okay, this just went from slightly dangerous to extremely dangerous because there was one crawled up on my hand and I got startled and I flicked it off of me. I need to go back and get the container. We need to get an ant. Alright, come on, get out of the stick. Got one. My hand is shaking, I got one. Nope, it came off. I got one, I got one. Back up, back up, back up. It's going right towards my hand. Oh boy. It's attacking the tip of the stick. I'm gonna put it down right here on the dirt. Yeah! Okay. All right, I'm gonna get it in this cup. Got it! Walked right in. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Holy yeah. cow! Oh my gosh! Yo, he is Hold so on, excited. Your legs, your legs. Same thing, oh. No, you're good. <laughs> you're good oh my gosh. Woo. <laughs> If I was that nervous just to catch the ant, I can't imagine how nervous I'm going to be to actually be stung by it. <sighs> ant is live, okay? It is out and active. I am going to now pick it up with the forceps. Got it. <sighs> there we go. That right there is a perfect hold right on the thorax. And wow, look at that. The stinger is already flying. Wow. Does that give you enough space there, Mark, to be able to see the stinger as it goes into my arm? It's yes, like sir. doing a We've million clear pulses. Visibility on the abdomen. Here it's we go. it's definitely to ready to sting. A little wooden base out of the way. Glass capsule is right here in frame. Forearm on the table. I'm Coyote Peterson, and I'm about to take on the bullet ant challenge. Are you ready? Let's do it. One, two, 
my gosh, this is it. Three. Get it off. off! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh. You are right? Oh my god, it is really bad! Oh my gosh, I think it has the trench lock topped! Oh. You are right, man? Yeah! Oh! Did you see that? You the just got shot! Was stuck into my forearm, by right a into the vein! Man. There is the sting insertion point right there! Oh my gosh! It is like... Oh, it's hot! Oh, I can feel the venom already, right in my forearm. <sighs> ah! <laughs> oh, it is. It's number one. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, it's burning more. It's getting worse. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah! Oh. ah! My whole arm is getting really tight. <sighs> oh my gosh, Mark, put your arm out here. Just tell them. Feel my forearm. Wow. Dude, it is like rock hard. I think it's spasming up the muscle. Now, the toxin that comes out of the stick uh, of a bullet in is a Panera toxin, which can cause it out. to hallucinate. So, I don't know how much venom actually went into my arm. All I know is that the stinger was in my forearm for a considerable amount of time. Uh, uh, Oh my gosh. <sighs> but I feel composed enough to give you guys a proper outro. Now they say that this pain is gonna last for 24 hours, and my goodness, if it does, I'm in for one wild day. But I think it goes without question that the bullet ant sting is the most painful that I have faced thus far on the insect sting pain index. However, as some of you may know, there are whispers that there is possibly a more painful sting out there. The warrior wasp may challenge the bullet ant's claim at the peak of the insect sting pain index. Am I going to be willing to take on that challenge? A warrior stay tuned wasp? And we'll find out. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next adventure. Woo! What a day. As we return this legendary creature back to its colony, the insect was immediately greeted by the other ants. Like a soldier, who had returned from a great battle and who would perhaps share its tale of the giant human it had defeated with a single sting. And as I watched this fearless gladiator disappear into the darkness, from my perspective, I too felt as if I had defeated a giant. A giant ladder I challenged myself to climb that we have all come to know as the insect sting pain index. I am proud to say I made it and that when it comes to the most painful sting in the insect kingdom, so far, it definitely belongs to the bullet ant. It has been a long 24 hours. Now, they say that the bullet ant is the 24 hour ant. My arm is still sore today. Guys, look at my arm. I think that the venom actually scarred the skin right there. I don't know if you can see it on my face. I'm exhausted barely slept at all last night because my arm was just like pulsating. I could feel these it hot still waves looks of pain like going swollen. through it. I guess we'll see where it's at in 48 hours. It's still stinging now. Legends are born from the stories we are told. And as they are passed down from generation to generation, they oftentimes become so grandiose, they are nearly impossible to believe. But when it comes to the legend of Bala, trust me when I say, the tales are true. If you thought the bullet ant sting was intense, make sure to check out the aftermath and the steps I took to immediately reduce the searing pain. And don't forget, subscribe so you can join me and the crew on this season of Breaking Trail. Man. I just got like chills. Like now they're talking about a warrior wasp. I've never heard of that. A warrior wasp? That sounds intimidating. Just the word wasp just
creeps me out and I'm getting goosebumps just thinking about it. Like, warrior wasp? That sounds like... That sounds like a warrior. Uh, and wasn't he just talking about, uh, like, a soldier or something like that coming back from a battle? Now he's about to go up against uh, a warrior wasp? Man. I don't know uh, what's going on. Like, it's uh, almost like he's going to be finding, like new species uh, like uh, by him doing this he's gonna try to get stunned by absolutely everything known to the animal kingdom <laughs> I don't know he, uh, this guy is really gutsy and he definitely deserves a lot of uh, credit with uh, the things that he does for our education and such so shout out to him completely now here's a an interesting thing though all of this stinging and such it's got me very intrigued to the point where I actually want to try it out. Like, I believe I mentioned this before in my other videos that would I do this stuff? I def I most likely would if it was for a good amount of, uh, I'm gonna just say money. Because <laughs> if I was to do uh, the bullet ant, if the pain is that, that stressful and that it hurts that bad you know, I better be I better be getting paid cash money type stuff man <laughs> you guys tell me in the comments below if you would ever do any of these challenges uh, do you have the guts for it maybe maybe not there's no shame because these things are very grotesque you could be able to get allergic reactions so it's very dangerous so obviously be careful if you do that but for me I most likely would just because of curiosity and obviously curiosity kills the cat and blah, 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 blah. but you know we have questions we want answers we want to try it out you know go out and explore that's what this guy is doing all right so comment down below if you would do this uh, and let me know for how much money uh, or for what it's worth that you would be willing to do it for uh, comment uh, in the videos if you want me to do more of these things. Uh, let me know if there's any um, other videos that you want me to do, any challenges, or any videos you want me to analyze because that's what my channel does. If you guys are new here, what I do is dance videos, reactions, analysis on videos, and challenges. So comment down below and we'll be able to interact with each other and I'll be able to do what you want to see. Alright, I'll catch you next time. <laughs>